What's up guys, I'm Anders with Adam Audio and today we're going to be talking about monitors versus headphones and what to use when. Let's jump right into it. There's no shortage of headphone or monitor companies out there, so how do you know what is best when you start out mixing, producing, or recording? Typically, we find that mixing on monitors is the way to go, and that's not just because we are mainly a monitor company. But when mixing on monitors, you'll be hearing what it sounds like in the real world, hearing natural room reflections and ambience. However, when mixing on the go, headphones are obviously necessary, and having a pair that you can trust is very crucial. So what's the difference sonically between the two? With headphones, you're naturally getting an enhanced stereo image because you're hearing direct sources on either side of your head, with no bleeding of the audio signal from the opposite side, eliminating what is called crossfeed. With crossfeed, even in a perfect stereo triangle, your right ear is still hearing a lower delayed signal of what the left monitor is producing and vice versa. The exaggeration of the stereo image can be helpful when mixing, but it can also be difficult to know that your mixes will translate elsewhere, because in any other stereo system, you'll be hearing a blended signal from both monitors. There are software and headphone amplifiers like the Grace M900 that compensate for this issue with crossfeed circuitry that simulates natural acoustic spaces so you can trust that what you're hearing is similar to your loudspeakers. It is a good rule of thumb to trust what you're hearing from your monitors first, then use your headphones as reference. Of course, there are exceptions to this rule. If you're starting out in an untreated studio space, headphones are gonna be your best friend. We know that untreated rooms are unreliable for any monitoring system, and there should be just as much thought and care putting into room treatment as in choosing the right monitors for you. Headphones can also be used as a microscope of sorts. Even in well-treated rooms, sometimes pops and clicks can go unheard through monitors, and having a pair of headphones that you can dive in and take out any unwanted anomalies is very helpful. In the end, it's a combination of the two, and using them to reference off of each other. And it's ultimately important to have a set of each that you trust. We hope this video helps clarify when it's beneficial to use monitors or headphones when you're mixing. Let us know in the comments below what you use, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more content.